Purple Heart recipient Detention Deputy Michelle Hallback was violently attacked by an inmate at Lake Wells Hospital. She fought for her life. Deputy Hallback sustained injuries to her head, including deep lacerations requiring multiple staples and a serious concussion. And I remember him running at me and we just got into a fight. And I remember seeing an object in his hand and him hitting me with it. And I remember the blood just squirting out everywhere. And, and I was dizzy, but I felt and knew just by the look in his eyes, I've got to fight for my life. He was trying to go for my weapon and I had my hand on the weapon and he was trying to get it and he hit me again with the object and I fell and he jumped on top of me and we were steady fighting. I was trying to hold on the weapon and fight him and he was fighting me and I remember getting a good kick in there. I'm not really sure where I kicked him at just to get up and I just jumped up and I grabbed the radio and I called for backup and I remember just seeing all this blood everywhere and I was just feeling really weak. I remember getting really dizzy and feeling like, oh God, am I, am I getting ready to die? And I remember all these nurses and officers coming to help me up and telling me it was going to be okay. And I said, well, and I asked the nurse and I looked there and I said, the only thing I'm asking you, just don't let me die out here like this on this ground. And I remember her saying, you're not going to die. You're going to be okay. And they rushed me back in. And maybe 10 to 12 minutes after being in the emergency room, some of the officers came back. And the officer um, for the Lake Wells Police Department, he came back and he gave me the thumbs up. He said, you did a good job and we got him. He was over there hiding. He didn't get that far away. To my, and he's butt naked with shackles on and a pair of socks.